Over the past few days, many images of the new Iranian drone launcher have surfaced on the internet and in the Iranian media. The drone, dubbed Shad 136, was combined with missiles and exercises Iran said took place last week. Iran calls this type of drone a suicide drone or kamikaze drone, meaning that it can fly directly at a target and self-destruct. Tom O'Connor, writing for Newsweek in January noted, imagery seen by Newsweek and confirmed by an expert who follows Iran's activities in the region shows the presence of Iran's Shad 136 weapon, also called a suicide drone, deployed to the northern Yemeni province of al Jaf, a territory of the state. Controlled by Ansar Allah, or the Houthis, the Zaidi Shia Muslim rebel movement. This is the first time this type of drone has been specified in an overseas deployment. Prior to this, Iran had built kamikaze drones, but this particular type had never been seen in military drills before. According to Iranian state media, the Shad 136 exists, and not just a kamikaze drone, but that Iran has created a new way for drone launches in the multiple launch format or drone swarming, reported the Jerusalem Post, Sunday. The drone swarm is a new technology where multiple drones are used to attack targets that can defeat air defenses. Currently Iran has invested heavily in kamikaze drone technology, including the type of drone known as the Kasif in Yemen and the Hamas Shahab drone. It is based on Iranian technology and models. A recent report at the Alma Research Center said that Hezbollah may have around 2,000 drones, many of which are based on Iranian models. The new launcher Iran unveiled in a recent exercise has five layers, or racks, on which drones can be mounted before launching. The launcher can be mounted on the back of the truck, so it can be disguised as cargo, looking like any other commercial truck crossing the road. Pro-Iran groups have even done this before in Iraq, where they installed 107mm or 122mm rockets in the back of trucks. In one documented case, they fired a rocket under the tailgate of an ordinary commercial truck to fire it at U.S. facilities in Iraq. In September 2020 Iran also stuffed rockets into shipping containers to hide them. Iran's new launcher for its Shad 136 ostensibly gives it the ability to not only see it, but also fit five drones into this convertible type of truck. It's conceivable dozens of these drones on target in a kind of crowd. While there's no evidence that drones can communicate with each other or that they have the kind of advanced artificial intelligence that exists in the West, this doesn't mean they don't pose a threat. A truck with a secret drone compartment can be used to attack targets or be used to improve air defenses. Iran did this in 2019 in Saudi Arabia, using drones and cruise missiles to attack Abqaiq. Despite having the right radar and air defenses, the Saudis were unable to stop the drones. Iran's advances since then are clearly the greater threat today across the region. The Shad 136 drone is very large, according to the drawings, but with a warhead, so it can pose a danger and is not easy to detect due to its altitude and small radar cross-section. Iran's progress with the Shad 136 novelty. The drones are based on drone designs used in other countries. Moreover, this is not the first country to dream up the idea of a dual-launch drone system. It is not known whether Iran used the Hera, a type of drone made by Israel Aerospace Industries IAI, as a model in 2020. Iranian launch systems differ in their positions and methods. However, the overall concept is the same. The concept is to provide the opportunity to launch multiple drones simultaneously. Reports in Newsweek in January said the Shad 136 had a range of about 2,000 kilometers. This is a great distance for such a small drone, but determined it is impossible to reach this range. However, the report coincided with claims that Iran had sent these drones to the Houthis in Yemen. 
The 2,000 km radius around Yemen means the drone could reach islet in southern Israel or threaten shipping ships in the Gulf of Oman. The threat of drone swarms of the kind Iran is now exhibiting is increasing. Iran has experimented with this before, its new launchers and new drones launching more serious threats than 2019. Currently Iran has invested heavily in kamikaze drone technology, including the type of drone known as the Kasif in Yemen and the Hamas Shahab drone. It is based on Iranian technology and models. A recent report at the Alma Research Center said that Hezbollah may have around 2,000 drones, many of which are based on Iranian models. The new launcher Iran unveiled in a recent exercise has five layers, or racks, on which drones can be mounted before launching. The launcher can be mounted on the back of the truck, so it can be disguised as cargo, looking like any other commercial truck crossing the road. 